Hosanna to the name of the Most High God. The Lord bless you. The face of the Lord shine upon you. This is your brother Bernard and I welcome you to another edition of our daily devotion. Let's see the book of Matthew chapter 26 from verse 48. Now his betrayer had given them a sign saying, Whomever I kiss, he is the one. Seize him. Immediately he went up to Jesus and said, Greetings, Rabbi, and kissed him. I want to speak briefly on what I've captioned, Kiss of Betrayal. This is a situation about Judas Iscariot, one of the 12 disciples of Jesus, a man who ought to stand with the master, support his ministry, support him emotionally, did the opposite. How painful can it be that the very people you have assisted, the very person you helped, you showed the way, you accepted him when everybody has rejected him. You took them by your side when there was no hope. You showed them the way. They found their feet on the ground. And all you could get from them is a kiss of betrayal. There are people who are still operating with the spirit of Judas Iscariot today. Where you assist people, you accommodate them, you put them into your space. And instead of appreciation, they pay you back by castigating you. Name callings, persecution, backbiting. Betrayer, a man by the name Joseph of the Arimathea, was a disciple of Jesus secretly. If he was the one who betrayed Jesus, I can understand because he was following Jesus and he is a Sahendrian, this group that opposed the ministry of Jesus with passion. If you want to live long, learn to appreciate people in the little they have contributed into your life. Because just as Judas ended, poor ending, many will end that way if they don't turn from this wicked scheme. Turn away from this wicked scheme of keys of betrayal. Learn to appreciate people. Nobody would know Judas Iscariot if Jesus Christ did not pick him up to make him one of his twelve. He picked him up, he believed in him, he trusted him and made him part of his team. But the appreciation is betrayer. When you betray a man that is on course with God, I mean on track with God, doing God's will, fearing God, you can be sure your end will be very disastrous. How can you forget so soon? The people who stood by you, how can you forget so soon the person who fed you? How can you forget so soon the person who gave you drink when you were thirsty? Learn to appreciate. If you are doing the opposite, which is a kiss of betrayal, I can guarantee you the end is not good. No matter how much you have gathered, it will scatter. The foundation is poor. Turn from that evil scheme and learn to appreciate. Stop calling people names that you know deeply in you. It's not true.
turn from that evil scheme. This is the word of the Lord for today. I remain your brother Bernard. I see you soon as the Lord lives. Stay under the canopy of God's grace and his mercy. Avoid the kiss of betrayer. Shalom.